Thanks so much. Now, as many of you know, the uh, Obama administration has now refused to, uh, to defend the Defense of Marriage Act. Right? All right. Yes, exactly. Because they recognize, you know, that if you're two consenting adults, and which of us isn't? It's nobody's business who you love, right? Right, Fort Bragg! All right. Nobody's business who you love, where you love, what equipment you might use. It's interesting, but it's nobody's business. And, uh, and yet the traditional values people are all upset over homosexuality in the workplace, in the movies, in the Boy Scouts, and they should just realize that homosexuality in the Boy Scouts is a tradition. <laughs> Why do you think they call it an outing? Every time we think about same-sex marriage, it makes us sick to our guts. I mean, to people who want to commit to a stable, monogamous, lifelong relationship, what are they, nuts? It's unnatural. Now a man should not lie with a person who is a guy. He should only lie to his wife. The Bible is clear. We're defenders of marriage in three button suits. We'll raise our double standard and see who salutes. Defenders of marriage, defending the institution against people who want to get married. Every time we think about same-sex parents, oh my gosh, we exclaim. I mean, to people who want to provide a protective and nurturing family environment, have they no shame? It's so deviant. It's the Lord's holy word, as my second wife said to my third. That a family's based on obligation and fear. We're defenders of marriage, connubial narcs, ever vigilant and patriotic patriarchs. Defenders of marriage, defending the institution against people who want to get married. One summer evening when my woman was doing laundry, I shared a six-pack with an old John Bircher. And oh so wisely he imparted an ancient quandary to ponder he says nature versus legislature. Are people born gay or do they turn gay just to piss off Dick Army? <laughs> We're an army of dicks with a militant stance. Let's get the government out of our lives and into our pants. Defenders of marriage, defending the institution against people who want to get married and have their insurance carried and be beneficiaried and be next to the ones they love when they are married. 